Hey there, so this is just a quick demo of this uh, cloud color mixer that I made in Substance Designer for Substance Painter texturing. Um, basically, a lot of times you want to add some, some subtle color variation to something, uh, a texture that you're working on, and this will just make it really easy to, to do that. So, I'm just going to go ahead and drag this into the shelf, hide that, go ahead and say the project. So, once it's here in the project, then you can just drag it in. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is set this to multiply and let's go ahead and take a look at the base color. Um, this will work with both uh, metalness workflow and uh, specular workflow in case you're interested in that so um, so either one but basically I'll just leave these two on. Right now we're seeing the base color and next thing I'm going to do is um, just change the scale something more reasonable and then let's go ahead and look at some of these settings so again this is set to multiply um, so this this noisy cloud uh, blend here this is a like kind of a different style of cloud so you can see if you want more like a noisier type cloud you can increase that um, this here for the color strength this is how much of it essentially so you can see nothing and it starts coming in uh, color contrast this is more like how hard these shapes are so if I turn it way up you can see it comes very um, separated and, and hard between the uh, the value aspect of it uh, color A you can change you can see right now it's with blue you can change it to like a green color B same, same thing, I'll uh, just change it to purple so you can see and I'll just leave this color C this uh, this blend here A to B so color A to B so if I want more A just push it that direction or more B push it that direction this other blend is B and C so push it the direction that you want push some more red in there this time and then the final blend is kind of like the combination of it all so um, it's actually between uh, this one and this one the result of, of this and this it's blend one and two so um, yeah and that's pretty much it like this scale you can play around with so if you want something um, this is like one of the base clouds that the function is working with so I can um, sort of like move the clouds around here with this and change the size and same thing with the other main cloud set you can change the size if you want and move them around yeah and that's pretty much it I just wanted to share this with you this is uh, something that I'm just going to put up for free so let me know if you enjoy it and it works out well for you or if you have any questions